Oh, Penelope, puffed Priscilla, I'm so excited. And do you know why? Of course I do, Priscilla. Next week is Puffin Bay's annual deep sea diving competition. And last year, you won, puffed Penelope. Yes, I did, pronounced Priscilla. My performance was perfect. Two minutes underwater. A regional record, I believe. Priscilla was particularly proud of her achievement. Puffins cannot only fly, but also they can swim and dive deep into the ocean and stay underwater for as long as two minutes. Penelope, why don't you participate this year? Oh, no way, Priscilla. It's too perilous a performance for me. You are much more courageous. Finally, the day arrived. Pat Periwinkle was the official judge of the competition and Penelope was helping him from the cliff top. All the puffins lined up along the cliff and Penelope checked that everyone was present. <coughs> Are you all ready? puffed Penelope. Phileas Puffin, ready. Paula and Primrose Puffin, ready. ready. Paul and Peter Puffin, ready. Oh, 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 wait a minute, we have a last minute entry. Finnegan Puffin, Finnegan Puffin, ready replied a gruff puff. Who's that, Priscilla? He's new to this area, put in Primrose Puffin. What a physique, she puffed. So dashing and... All right, all right, Primrose. Good looks aren't everything, you know. I am the reigning regional champion, may I remind you. Priscilla, stop being so presumptuous. I know it's a competition and you want to win, but we are supposed to have fun, puffed. Penelope. Pat Periwinkle signalled to Penelope that he was ready for the first dive. So Penelope whistled loudly. <whistles> first puffin puff forward. Ready, steady, go. Peter Puffin flew down and dived into the choppy sea. Pat was timing his dive. One minute. 40 seconds, Peter. Well done. Next. Paul, followed by Phileas, did the same, but with disastrous results. One minute, three second, boys, proclaimed Pat. Then Paula and Primrose performed excellent dives. One minute, 50 seconds. At last, it was Priscilla's turn. She swooped down and her dive was spectacular, lasting two whole minutes. Finally, it was Finnegan Puffin's turn to dive. Ready to dive, puffed Penelope. Pronto, pronounced Finnegan. Then he flew, flipped and dipped into the ocean. Everyone held their breath. Penelope had joined everyone on Pat's boat. Eagerly awaiting, Pat counted. One minute, 30 seconds. One minute, 50 seconds. Priscilla was preoccupied. Two minutes, said Pat. Oh no, gasped Penelope. Two minutes, 10 seconds, pronounced Pat as Finnegan emerged from the depths of the ocean. Well done, well done, puffed everyone in admiration. Priscilla, puffed Penelope, are you all right? Of course I am, Penelope. I'm just a little disappointed. Never mind. I mean, Finnegan was fantastic, fabulous, and what more can I say? Then Pat called on all the puffins to get ready for the award ceremony. Well, everyone, thank you for participating. And this year, we have a new champion. Now, I want you all to flap for our podium. Third place, Paul Puffin. Second place, Priscilla Puffin. And this year's winner, Finnegan Puffin. 
congratulations to you all. We certainly had a wonderful time. And remember, the most important thing is to have fun. Now, how about everyone going back to Pearl's Cottage for a nice cup of tea?